slave trade in West Africa. In West Africa, slave trade was huge. People made a living off slave trade. It was almost a way of life. Slaves were a way of life. They did field work, helped around the house, and many other chores. People made money off of slaves as well as selling them or trading them. Transportation between 1650 and 1860, approximately 10 to 15 million enslaved people were transported from Western Africa to the Americas. Most were shipped to the West Indies, Central America, and South America. One boat they used to transport slaves was the snow. It could carry around 450 people. They stored the slaves under the boat in bad conditions, cramming them together, fitting as many slaves on the boat as possible. the slaves. Once in the Americas, slaves were sold by auction to the person that bid the most money for them. It was here that family members would find themselves split up, as a bidder may not want to buy the whole family, only the strongest and healthiest member. When the slave ship docked, the slaves would be taken off the ship and placed in a pen like this one. They stayed in the pens for days. Well, unless someone came to buy them. Slave auctions were advertised when it was known that the slave ship was due to arrive. Posters, like the one pictured left, would be displayed around town. The slave trade between Western Africa and the Americas reached its peak in the mid-18th century, when it is estimated over that 80,000 Africans annually cross the Atlantic to spend the rest of their lives in chains. A slave purchased on the African coast for the equivalent of 14 English pounds in bartered goods in 1760 could sell for 45 pounds on the American market. Healthy men usually costed more than women or young children. This is a device to control unruly slaves, as well as whips. <laughs> Slavery still exists in the world today. And you can find memories of slave trade in Africa today, such as statues. Thanks for watching.